topic. Now for best R&B song, Push Your Love Girl, one which was written uh, Justin Timberlake, who many felt were, you know, snubbed from some of the main categories. A mm -hmm. lot of people expected him to win best album. He did win best R&B song that was written by James Fauntleroy, Jerome Harmon, Tim Mosley, a.k.a. Timberland, and of course Justin Timberlake. So shouts and congratulations to them. And uh, Rihanna actually won an award earlier as well. Charlie. Oh, you can come oh, on, on in. You're come a winner on in. You guys are good. We're not going to wait for anything. Come on in, Charlie. Nice to meet you. Congratulations, Stan. Right here, Ben. Great to meet you. Caduce. Nice to meet you. Right here, smack dab in the middle. Congratulations, winners for Best Blues Album tonight. Really amazing for Get Up. How are you guys feeling right now? Oh, man, I'm on a cloud. In fact, I'm out of my body. I'm up here somewhere, you know? <laughs> I saw you guys posing for the pictures just next door. You guys looked like you were having so much fun. Ben, what is that? What does this moment feel like backstage for you? It's the time of my life, and as Charlie said, it, there's, it, there's an out-of-body aspect to it all, and so you try to just kind of stay grounded and uh, reel it in and just take it in. Yeah, That's awesome. It's not going to hit me till tomorrow sometime. Yeah, I'm I mean, with you. What did you think your chances were going into tonight? Is this something that you're taken aback and shocked by? I thought we had a good chance, and, and everybody that was nominated are all good people. Yeah. Yeah. And uh, I'd have been happy for anybody, but I'm especially happy for me. Absolutely. Yeah. Absolutely. Now, when you guys went in and recorded this record, is this the ultimate goal that you had? Was it to be on this stage tonight, be in this room, winning a Grammy? Uh, no. Uh, it, you, know, you make a record to, uh, to serve your creative instincts as sincerely as possible and hope it, it, it uh, stands the test of time. And, but with that said, if that is part of uh, what comes from that commitment to, to your creative sincerity, it doesn't get any better. It definitely does not. Yeah, so I don't want to, you know, undermine how honored. <laughs> no, of course, but you don't go in going, we're making this, we're going to win a Grammy with this record right here. No. Because then you'd be pandering with your music. <laughs> it wouldn't be really authentic to where you're at. I bet some people have said that and done that with good music. Sure. But, but that's just my, my way is just kind of yeah, making the, the best music. Way. If you think I'm going to make this record so it'll win a Grammy that's not the spirit of the music it's, no it's not you know we were playing the music from our hearts and with love and and happiness and you do that first then you see what happens see how people like it wow it and sure I, is nice to get the validation huh oh yeah. my god <laughs> from your peers in the blues community as well it, yeah. that just resonates because you know Mag Elmore magazine yeah. and, and living blues and the blues community supported this record of course charlie musselwhite but I, i'm somewhat of a newcomer to this I, although I've, I've devoted my life to blues this is the true real living blues and oh yeah so uh for the community to have come out and rallied behind this it was a huge honor for me so a shout out to the blues community to sheldon gomberg who produced and engineered this record and uh to my to my beloved woman Jacqueline Mathis. Yes. Who do you want to take? You can take the time since we are on basically the second camera for the Grammys right now. Is there anybody that you want to go out there to, and send any thanks to or anything that you want to say to everybody watching at home? Now that you're back on Earth? <laughs> you mean people are not musicians? I mean just people? Well, yes, sir. everybody in Clarksdale, Mississippi. Here, here. <laughs> yes. The Delta Blues Museum. Here, here. So what are you guys going to do with your Grammy? Where do you store this award? Have you thought about it? There's an exalted place in my office yeah. that'll it'll be just fine right there. <laughs> That's Very appropriate. Awesome. Great. Well, listen, it's such a great Thank pleasure to meet so you much. guys, Thank and you congratulations much. on the big Grammy win. Thank you very much. I'm looking forward to seeing that exalted Grammy all up in your Thank office. You Absolutely.